In this video, we will see how to select in geometry nodes. Create a curve object and apply geometry nodes to it. Add an instance on point node. Connecting the cube to the instance socket places the cube at a point on the curve. Since we are going to see how to freely select each curve point, we will add a resample curve node. Reduce the size of each cube to make it easier to see. Let's see how to select each cube using the selection socket of the instance on points node. First, the instance number is as follows. When you connect to an index node, all instances except for instance 0 are selected. If we add a math node and adjust the value in add mode, we can select deselect one by one from the front. In modular mode, depending on the value, we can select one by one, or we can select more diversely. We can also select from the beginning in less than mode. In compare mode, we can select only the desired instance number through the value value. With an additional add mode, we can also select the separate instances at the same time. For curves, there is an endpoint selection node that makes the selection more intuitively and easy. By adding only one node, we can increase the selection from the front. We can also increase the number of choices from the back. Spline parameters and color ramp nodes can be used to make selections more visually comprehensible. We just look at how to make a selection on geometry nodes. 